Hi, this is Savitri Wilder and today I want to show you how you can use GIMP to layer your images onto a photo frame and then print it out so you can use it on your paper scrapbook. I have Adobe Bridge here open. This is what I use to um, organize my images, but it's not something that you're required to have to work on this. Um, in Bridge, I can right click and select Open With and go to GIMP. And this will open up my photo frame here. And once I have this open, I can go ahead, um, let me just minimize this real quick. I can go ahead and insert the pictures in here. So I'll go to File, and you want to select Open as Layers because in many photo applications you want to work in layers. This way you can select each layer and move them around as needed. They'll be indi um, separate individual pieces. So click on Layers and go to where your images are. And here's the picture, and as you can see, it's pretty large. So you want to go into the Scale tool in the toolbox and just double click it. And make sure down in the bottom, Keep Aspect Ratio is checked. And just select anywhere in the picture, and it'll pop up this scaling box. And I did an earlier measurement, but if I do 650 here, it'll fit perfectly into the box. Um, but if not, it's just trial and error. And click on scale and GIMP will do its thing. And sometimes you can't see where the image is and you'll just have to click on view and zoom out a little bit. And see here's where the image is. And to move it, you want to select the move tool now. And there it is. Let's zoom back in. And since we're working in layers, as you can see here on the right, you have two different layers. There's the um, frame and here's the image. The image is currently above the frame right now and so you want to go ahead and just uh, hold down your left mouse button and just drag it down and you should see a line under background and this basically means you can let go of your left mouse button and now the photo is under the frame and as you can see here the photo is now underneath it and you can you know move this around however you want until you're happy with however it's looking under there so we did one We'll go on to the next one. Go back to File and open it up as a layer. And go back to your picture. And go to this. Open it. Same deal, it's large, so we have to go back to Scale. And just click anywhere in the picture. And set back up again. Again, it's somewhere hidden, so we'll go and zoom out. There it is. Make sure you have your Move Tool option selected. And double click on the image and place it wherever you want. Perfect. Then we'll go open as a layer again. Go back and browse your picture. Here's the last one. scale click anywhere size this push the scale button oops I need to remember to click on the move tool and then you can move it let's zoom back in so that we can have a better look at where our pictures are. And 
just get this bigger. Okay, that looks pretty good. Now if you want to add anything else, let's go back to bridge and I have this printable. Let's say I want to add the word love in there. I'll just go ahead and insert, open as a layer, and I'll go to my download, go to that next folder, and we'll insert that. And let's make this a little smaller so I can see my layer here. And right now, the word love is under the um, template or under the frame, so I want to move this up above it and then make sure that I have my, it is still selected, I have my move button here still. So move this, let's move this to the side here. And if you want to rescale it just a tad bit, you can. There. That's good. There we go. All right. Once you're done, you can go up to image and you want to click on print size. Set this to inches. My photo printer is only six by four max width and height. So I'm going to change this to six. Automatically change the height and click OK and up to file and I'm ready to print. And that's it. GIMP is a free application. You can go to www.gimpgimp.org. Thanks for watching.